Olivia, you're one of the yards that has been shut down. How worried are you by the situation? Um, obviously, it's not ideal, and just hoping that all our horses, you know, come back after the test negative, and that no further cases are found. And I think the BHA are doing a good job nipping it in the bud early, and hopefully they have caught, um, you know, all, all the cases very early, and it hasn't spread to other yards. And you know, we just hope that by stopping racing, it stops the spread, and we can um, sort the problem out and get back racing as soon as possible. And what measures have you put in place to protect your string? So, as we had two runners at, at, um, at Air where infected, an infected yard also had runners, um, we've been put in isolation. So, um, in effect, we can't take any horses out of the yard. Um, no people except our, our own staff come into the yard um, for the time being. Um, uh, the two horses that ran at Air have gone into isolation. So just one member of staff is looking after them and not going near any other any of the other horses. Um, we've done a lot. We disinfect all the stables anyway, um, but we've just obviously upped that and disinfected and fogged all the stables, all the gear, all the racing gear, um, and just just made sure that you know that everybody's aware um, of the situation and not to go and mix with any staff from the infected yard. I mean, if they do, just to you know, shower and wash their clothes uh, before they come back to the yard. Um, we, we've actually just kept on as normal. Um, some yards I don't think have been riding out and stuff, but you know, our vets were, were quite keen that we kept the routine as normal, just so that the horses didn't get in any stress, heightened stress, um, so thus not to you know, have any more chance of catching the, the uh, virus.